What is up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for being here. This is Beer Talk with Kyle and Joe. I'm Kyle. What's up, guys? Of course, my name is Joe. And you saw the title. You saw the thumbnail. Today, we want to share with you guys, in our opinion, as of now, what are some underrated companies that you maybe haven't tried that we think you should give a try because they have some quality products. Now, keep in mind, the term underrated can mean different things to different people. So again, just in our opinion, these are some products that we think aren't in enough hands and should be. Yeah. Yeah. And this was a video that we did last year as well that we found to be very successful. Uh, you guys had a lot of great thoughts and opinions on that as well. So are there going to be some companies that are still on this underrated list from last year? Or are there some newer companies that we really think need to be in the spotlight more? But before we dive into that, stay tuned after this intro and we'll be right back. All right, guys, welcome back from the intro. We're going to go ahead and dive right into it. Before we do, um, we just want to let you know that Joe and I actually did this list together. So we're going to have five companies total that we want to share with you. Again, these are underrated companies in our opinion. All right, let's go ahead and dive right into it. I'll kick us off here. The first company that I want to show off is Southern Beard Co. Uh, this is a company that we've worn for a little while now. We've tried a decent amount of their products. They make really quality products. They're small batch. They have a lot of different scents, a lot of different products to try. Yeah. Yeah. And one of the, the bottle that he was holding up is the newer premium uh, blend. They mm -hmm. have uh, two different uh, blends you can choose from for all their products. Um, and the really cool thing is, which we are always amazed at, is all the orders are made to order, uh, yeah. which is always very impressive. Uh, so, yeah, I definitely think Southern Beer Company is just a company that really needs to get into more people's beards. Um, honestly, until we see it, they will probably continue to be on this list uh, <laughs> right. just because they are really that good. Mm -hmm. Yep. And then um, our next one is going to be uh, Fetty Says. And I do have a bottle here I can show yep. off here. Now, Fetty Says is a company that is newer to us. And I believe they are somewhat of a newer company, but I definitely think they meet that threshold of what an underrated company should be. There's definitely a few people that we've seen uh, on Instagram show off some of their products. But overall, I really think that they are a company that needs to hit more beards. Um, yeah. They have some really unique, cool scents uh, for sure. And each of their scent comes with a different uh, blend. So their uh, so their oils, you're going to get a little bit of a different experience uh, with each scent, which is something that maybe some people don't like, but I think most people do. Uh, definitely something that we find to be unique. Yeah, that's a bit of a risk that Fetty takes by doing that. But I'll tell you, we tried multiple scents and obviously multiple form oil formulas, and they he really pulls it off. It, it, I've never tried anything from Fetty that you can't tell is homemade, and a lot of time and effort was put into it. So, I, yeah, we definitely completely agree. Fetty is an underrated company. Yeah. All right. So the next one that we want to go to here is T3 Beard Co., mm. and that is one of their scents. This is a great company. Um, this one, especially, you don't, you just don't hear a lot of buzz about it. When I think of T3, their feel and beard oil is sensational. But more than that, they make the lightest, fluffiest whip butter off the top of my head that I can think of that I absolutely love. I did try their poured butter as well. Really good stuff. Yeah, no, they're yeah, they're definitely an underrated company to say the least. Um, mm -hmm. You know, again, you know, a company that we would love to see more people, you know, show off more of their products with, uh, have have them in their beards more. Really good. I think that a lot of people talk about their butters, but I really think their oil is something that is really unique um, mm -hmm. and, and really good as well. Um, I think overall everything just feels really good in your beard. I know when he posts the new items which we really need to get our hands on more. Um, he has a lot of unique artwork and really good inspirations and things like that. And Troy, who's the owner, is a really good person to talk to when we have the chance to do so. All right. <clears throat> All right. Uh, and the next one is going to be uh, Beard Brothers. 
Now, this is a company that uh, has been around for uh, a little while now and a company that really, I think when we did the review, we talked about how we were surprised they were, um, you know, uh, around as long as that as, as they were, but they were new to us. And when we did the review, we covered uh, their entire scent line and a lot of their scents are just really good, really fun. Uh, nothing that was like too extravagant, but good, really made simple scents. Uh, uh, one that really stood out to us was like their lemon scent that just smelled really good, really, uh, really like a delicious uh, type scent. Um, and we were just really think they're doing really great solid things with all their products. Definitely got to give them a try. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Completely agree. Underrated company. Like Joe said, like I, I see, po- <clears throat> excuse me. Excuse me. I see posts and different things like that. I just don't see them on a consistent basis. I don't I don't hear that buzz. One thing I love about them is they're not reinventing the wheel. They have ingredients that you've heard of. They have products that you heard of. They just do them really well. Um, So, you know, in that case, I think they're worth giving a try for sure. And, And they got you a little choked up. So and they got me a little choked up. Yes, I didn't start crying, but I was very close. So our next and final company is Bloombeards. This is a not really a, re- a new company, but kind of new to like the YouTube world, the social media world, if you will. Um, I love this company. Uh, this company has the sense, the feeling beards, the balms. A lot of people don't wear balms anymore, but I still do. Um, just all around great top notch, small batch. And Joe kind of has a unique story with the owner. Yeah. Uh, so for those who don't know, uh, John and I began talking on Instagram really just randomly out of the blue and we come to find out that we only live 10 minutes from each other. Uh, so we've had the chance to interact quite a bit. Uh, we've become, you know, really, really close and John is doing really good things. Um, at first, when we decided that we were going to put Bloom Bids on this list, I was like, well, are they underrated? Cause they're kind of new, but at the same time, I'm glad Kyle brought that up. They've been around a while, but just more on the local scene. Uh, So I really definitely think they do fit that mold of underrated. The first thing that I think of when it comes to Bloom Beards, you would think would be the beard product, but it's really the customer service. John will bend over backwards to make sure that you are 100% satisfied with all of your products. Uh, He talks to me me about actually uh, hand delivering products to a lot of our local uh, residents around here, which is really cool. And then of course, the products themselves really, really speak highly. The oil is just an outstanding feeling. The butter is absolutely fantastic fantastic mm-hmm. and like Kyle I love balms as well it does a wonderful job too yeah yeah for sure John John's an awesome guy great company um, make sure you guys check him out so this video like we said strictly was just possibly these are companies that you have not tried that we think you should give a try throw a comment below what do you think of our list and then more importantly than that let us know because maybe we haven't tried companies that you think are underrated because we, we're always looking to try different companies all right guys but that is the end of the video joe anything else to close it out no sir let's wrap it up all right guys that's all the time that we have for you today as always keep it growing and we'll talk to you at the next one Cousins out.